Hey, what's up, Zaki Senpai here. Haven't shown my faces. I do got a lot more better now, but I'm sorry I'm very new to this news. The moment I got back from work, I just sleep. And nowadays, I feel like the only free time I have is like three to four hours due to how busy work is. So we're gonna talk about Premier Collab, and I'm gonna go through how insanely expensive the skin is, and how greedy it is, is. and I can't state the fact that I'm still gonna be pulling for it because I'm such a big Premier fan. So we come down here, we got Jojo who's gonna be released, I think it's probably tomorrow, right? Uh, it's released one hour ago. Hopefully it's not too loud. Okay, there we go. Jojo, it's a penguin and... Well, it seems like it can fly, it's very interesting. Omnidirection? Okay, so it just crashes into someone. I can't really see, it. Like, okay, he shoot bombs, okay. And wow, that's a crazy AoE. So he shoot like a bomb, like a, he shoot bombs like the way uh, Doomlight shoot his turrets. What? What is that? What is that? What is that? What is that? Okay, I think that's his secondary attack. I don't know dash attack, secondary primary attack. Okay, that's it about him. I guess talking about Promir. Now Jojo is definitely not everyone's favorite design, but I think it is powerful in its own way. A lot of people say he looks seems kind of tiny, but he's okay. Now we're gonna talk about Primary Collab. So we're gonna go from the bottom. I, I read all those terrible comments and I don't wanna read it again. So we'll talk about the skin first. So we got first Rome is gonna be Galatimos. And this is going to be an ass skin. Okay, so it's gonna be begin July 14 in case you still don't know. Uh, Galatimos is a firefighter. So if we go up, we got Cyrus skin. A lot of people are complaining how short um, uh, Leo is gonna be. Leo Fotia. Eh? Leo Fota, yeah. So it's gonna start on 14, same banner I guess. I, I have a feeling it might be a different banner but I'm not really sure. So a lot of people were expecting this to be Yutong. But uh, yeah, if you watch the anime, right, Galatimus is actually much more taller than Leo by a lot. Uh, I'm showing you a few pictures here. So whether you wanna keep complaining or not, I think people who watch Premiere can accept it. I think people who did not watch Premiere probably don't know and probably don't mind. <laughs> so we got Leo's Fotias Matte Burnish. So they mentioned that this is going to be Cyrus S plus skin, which I kinda don't think so. Uh, there's a possibility that this might be a Mecha skin, an S plus Mecha skin. It's just that they mentioned that it's gonna be uh, Leo's Fotias armor. I don't know. That could be wrong, but so far they mentioned it's Cyrus skin and a lot of people has been complaining on the China server that why is this a skin while Matoy tag, this one, <laughs> It's a flamingo skin. They, they they are going out of words. It feels like NetEase did not really watch Promare themselves. Now now the, the pilot skins are acceptable, but this one is a pilot skin, which I can't accept. It's supposed to be a mecha, which I highly think it will be a mecha. They just maybe mentioned it as an armor. But if it's really a pilot skin, I'm really disappointed because they're actually the same height as you can see right here in the anime. So if we take a look at my toy attack as a flamingo, a lot of people are saying, hey, wh where does it shoot? Well, if you haven't watched the anime yet, uh, my toy attack spear can actually shoot out uh, some sort of blaster ice. But again, um, it's a very weird collab. You can see that the pilot skins are right there, which I, I, I never thought about this. I thought this is going to be an S+, plus, but this is crazy. So we got one S, a two S, one S+, plus, and one SS skin. So this is going to be... One banner, I hope. I hope it's not two banner. If, if by understanding, I hope it's one banner. So we're gonna talk about the main skin right now. The main skin. Now this thing right here is going to be Ventorus. It has been confirmed. You can see it. Uh, Ventorus Chinese name was written right there. And in order to get this skin, you need to have the Mad Burnish S Plus skin. You need to have Matoy Tech. Aside that. You still need to have two flash pass card or flash card. I don't know what you would call. Now that is actually quite expensive. So meaning that if you if you want to do it all in one, this banner. If you never have a flash pass, you need to do maybe two two. You gotta pull for two SS and then maybe three S plus and something like that. I I really don't know, but it feels like it could be sitting around two to two hundred fifty dollars. There's a potential right there. And that's insanely crazy, but still it's very cool. And a lot of people were asking about the transformation when it transforms into Ventorus Dragon Mode. It could be changed from Leo de Galon to Galo de Leon if you watch the anime into the white form. I don't know, but possibly. Will it have EX form? I, I don't know as well, but that's that's it. 
that I do my explanation and it is actually quite very expensive. I can just translate to you right here. After obtaining the Tangle of Flight outfit, the SS and the Fury Matte Burnished Armor Leo in the Premier Linked Price Pool, exchange two flashcards to get this. This is insane. This is very insane. I hope it's not time limited. If it's time limited, it, it will be very expensive. I'm sorry I'm not showing my face. I'm I'm I really <clears throat> I know I'm gonna spend on it, but I still think it's in, it, insanely and expensive. This is outrageous, but I can't believe it. <laughs> they got me good this time. Thank you all so much for watching. Zeki Senpai here, and yeah, uh, if you don't have the money, I don't recommend you going for it. I hope it's not time limited. Like you can unlock it later when you have two flash bars. Anyways, thank you all so much for watching. Zeki Senpai here, and <coughs> oh cough. Hey, it's just a gaming channel.